This month's snack box brought to us by Japan. We've uh, got three uh, b bags of uh, Eats by Haruya. The first one on the left is Osumo. A savory snack in the theme of a sumo wrestler it features a core of crunchy rice crackers enveloped in a savory layer of seasoning. Yeah, they're all twisty. I noticed the arms. And then this, I was like, wait a minute. Look at this. Well, that's kind of nice. And then this one's barbecue snack. Captures the essence of smoky, savory flavors in every bite, featuring a mo medley of crispy rice crackers infused with the irresistible taste of barbecue seasoning. Looks like barbecue Chex Mix, it looks like. Okay, they're actually a little bigger and a little more, uh, thinner. Yeah, these filled me with, like, a little confidence. They'd be, like, kind of, like, salty in a way. Or, like, really sweet on the side barbecue kind of thing. There's, like, skewers here. That's also okay, too. Nothing too strong yet. And then we go right to the... See if the crab can do that. Connie! Also by Haruya. Delectable fusion of crispiness and indulgence. Meticulously crafted to offer a taste of culinary excellence. These savory snacks feature thinly sliced crispy chips with a taste of crab. Ooh, that crab stuff definitely hit when I opened the bag. They look like kind of like a little pinkish in a way. So add that to the list of like crab tasting uh, snackages I've had over the months here on uh, treats. And then two more things here. First, Pocket Monster Cookie by Furuta. Yes, Pokemon. Uh, a treat that brings the Pokemon universe to life in a cookie that boasts a, delicious, a deliciously buttery flavor and a satisfying crunch that'll have you reaching for more. Just got a little... Uh, What's this, Palmy? I think it's what it's called. Not familiar with, like, the newer stuff. I know that's the one you gotta... I think you walk this, and then it gets it evolves or something along the... <laughs> Read something like it. Oop, kind of broke off inside, but... Yeah. Ooh, get a good look at that. Ooh, looks real good. It's like chocolate, but not, like, really super strong or super sweet or anything like that. I mean, it has its own sweetness to it. That's not bad. And then we got the Perinko Plum by Sanko. Sanko? Rice cracker flavored to deliver an umami fix with salt is sparingly applied. Perfect snack when you're looking for something a little quieter while you chat with guests at the coffee table. Hmm. Ooh, that is very tasty. Guests at the coffee table, I thought it'd be like a sweet cracker, but no, it's like zesty. Mmm. I love that. That last one from Ireland was uh, going to be tough to top, I gotta admit, but, th but near the end, some of these were pretty good, like these last two. Three was like, oh no, these were kind of okay-ish. 